audience, my name is Mary Ness and Prosperity. Editor Mary would like to welcome you for visiting and here is the official news. One, Jack Antonoff lied to Adam Sandler to get his wife Margaret Qualley a role in Happy Gilmore Two Feet Jack Antonoff helped his wife, Margaret Qualley, land a role in Adam Sandler's upcoming film. Happy Gilmore Two by lying to Sandler. Qualley confirmed her involvement on The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon, expressing her excitement about the opportunity. Despite having a small role as deep background, she shared her enthusiasm for the original 1996 film, stating it was a significant moment for her. 2. Shirtless Aaron Taylor Johnson soaks up the sun with wife Sam Taylor Johnson on coastal vacation Aaron Taylor Johnson is enjoying a coastal vacation with his wife, Sam Taylor Johnson. He shared a series of fun photos on social media, including a romantic picture of them together by the ocean a selfie taken by Sam, and images of Aaron shirtless and having fun. The post, captioned Rainbow Wave Little Getaway Two Hearts, indicates they took a break from their UK home to enjoy some time together. 3. What Taylor Swift told Travis Kelsey before his acting debut in Grotesquery Taylor Swift is encouraging Travis Kelsey to embrace new opportunities, particularly in acting. Ryan Murphy who directed Kelsey in the upcoming FX series, Grotesquery, shared that Swift is very supportive of Kelsey's interests and wants him to pursue them. Murphy praised Swift, calling her sweet and lovely, and noted that Kelsey didn't need any acting tips, as he is naturally charismatic and talented. 4. Donna Kelsey reacts after being confused for Taylor Swift's mom Andrea Swift Donna Kelsey recently addressed confusion on social media when a fan mistakenly identified her as Taylor Swift's mom. Andrea Swift The mix-up started when actor Mark Hamill commented on a photo of Andrea at a Chiefs game, and a fan reposted it, tagging Donna instead. This led to speculation among users about the mix-up between the two mothers. However, Donna responded positively to the fan, expressing her appreciation for the support. 5. Why Margot Robbie and Jacob Elordi's Wuthering Heights movie casting is sparking a social media debate Margot Robbie and Jacob Elordi are set to star in Emerald Fennel's adaptation of Emily Bronte's Wuthering Heights, Robbie who is pregnant, will play Catherine opposite Elordi's Heathcliff. However, their casting has sparked criticism on social media, with users arguing that neither actor embodies the psychologically tortured essence needed for the roles. Some suggested alternative actors, like Elle Fanning and Dev Patel, as better fits for the characters, citing Robbie and Elordi's modern looks as a mismatch for the classic story. Six, Travis Kelsey's jaw-droppingly luxe birthday gift to Patrick Mahomes revealed Patrick Mahomes celebrated his 29th birthday with a memorable surprise from his best friend and Kansas City Chiefs teammate Travis Kelsey, who gifted him a luxurious Louis Vuitton golf bag valued between $22,600 and $31,500. Mahomes, who enjoys golfing humorously questioned the practicality of such an extravagant gift for use on the course. The celebration included a private party on September 15, attended by teammates and Kelsey's girlfriend. Taylor Swift, 7. 
Why Blake Shelton is comparing Gwen Stefani relationship to Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's romance Blake Shelton expressed his support for Taylor Swift's relationship with Travis Kelsey during an appearance on The Pat McAfee Show. He praised the couple for being open about their romance, likening it to his own public relationship with Gwen Stefani. Shelton emphasized the importance of owning their relationship and being proud of each other, suggesting that their openness reflects their strong feelings for one another. 8. Jason Kelsey has cheeky response to critic Embarrassed by his dancing Jason Kelsey, a former NFL star. Showcased his dance moves before the Philadelphia Eagles game against the Atlanta Falcons on September 16, which drew mixed reactions online. One critic expressed embarrassment over his performance. But Kelsey humorously embraced the criticism, referencing his wife Kylie's frequent comments about his antics. He enjoys making her laugh, even if it means embarrassing her. Kelsey a father of three daughters with Kylie, has previously demonstrated his light-hearted personality, including a moment during his ESPN debut where he forgot his travel bag. 9. Travis Kelsey's mom Donna Kelsey has a hat bearing tributes to Taylor Swift and her son Donna Kelsey has created a unique fashion accessory to celebrate her son Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift's relationship. At the Kansas City Chiefs season opener against the Baltimore Ravens on September 5, she wore a black Chiefs baseball cap featuring custom embroidery. The hat showcases sprigs of holly and a white cosmos, representing the birth months of Travis and Taylor, along with Travis's jersey number, 87. The design has gained popularity on social media with embroidery artist Alexa Perlmutter sharing her excitement about the creation on TikTok. 10. Former bad boy rapper Shine Barrow says Sean Diddy Combs destroyed his life Moses Shine Barrow. A former rapper and protege of Sean Diddy Combs has spoken out following Diddy's recent arrest, describing him as someone who destroyed my life. In a press conference, Shine recounted how as an 18-year-old aspiring artist, he defended Diddy during a 1999 nightclub shooting incident that led to Shine's conviction for first-degree assault. He served nine years in prison. While Diddy was acquitted after claiming self-defense. After his release in 2009, Shine was deported to Belize, where he now serves as the leader of the opposition in the House of Representatives.